Um, <coughs> ACSC, as a five-year initiative, has a limited life. Um, and so at the center, we are looking toward, presently, toward the sort of what next. Um, <coughs> and <coughs> there are really two, um, two things that we think we can take from ACSC and build on. And one is this integrative approach that I refer to. Uh, <coughs> that takes seriously the engagement between different academic disciplines, but also between academic disciplines and the role of practice, policy, and so forth. But also the emerging SC, ACSC framework, and this is what I'd like to talk about now um, briefly. And, and in the next bunch of slides on this framework, I want to acknowledge Paul Hirsch uh, from Georgia Tech, who um, has put this presentation together. We've been working carefully closely with him. Um, <coughs> this is the, the, the framework is a framework essentially for analyzing case studies. And um, I want to be forthright here. Um, the ACSC process, the planning, we had a two-year planning process, and then and, you know, now, as I said, we're in year three, was difficult. It was difficult because we were trying to cross those disciplinary divides. We were, we were um, dealing with, with academics, talking to practitioners, and not communicating. We were dealing with using terms that we thought we um, had a common you know, an agreement on in terms of what they meant, uh, only to discover um, <coughs> that, uh, that we meant very different things. Um, <coughs> uh, sometimes, if, if you worked in interdisciplinary studies, you know that some people tend to think that you, know, you, you get into these arguments where you know, my, my, my theory is bigger than your theory. Um, <coughs> and, and so there were some moments that were, that, that at the time felt unproductive, but I think ultimately you know, really made us face these, these, these kinds of, of, of um, uh, tensions, if you will, um, as something that characterizes interdisciplinary and integrative research. <clears throat> and we took that to heart, that challenge and that difficulty. And this, to me, is one of the things, as someone who's tried to work across disciplines a good part of my career, this is something that, that to me, is very appealing about uh, <clears throat> the trade-offs focus. I also, if I can position this sort of personally, as this initiative developed, I was the sort of person in the planning group who was most opposed to the idea, of, to, to focusing on the idea of trade-offs, because it felt too economistic to me, um, and too, too limited um, <clears throat> to, to sort of one perspective on the world. Um, and whereas I was, I was trying to be a, a, in the sort of planning process, I would say I was trying to be a voice for pluralism. That we need different kinds of perspectives. Um, <clears throat> I have subsequently come to uh, embrace the, the, the trade-offs focus because I think trade-offs is a really great concept for talking across disciplines and talking across domains. It's a kind of a common meeting area, um, as long as we can acknowledge that there are very different ways of, 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 of even thinking about what a trade-off is and how you analyze it and how you document it um, and so forth. But in any case, what we have developed is <coughs> a framework that we think will be useful in analyzing particular case studies. Um, and we've been continuing. This is a work in progress, OK? I want to say that right away. Um, We've had now a series of three workshops in Peru, Tanzania, and Vietnam in which our country partners put together case studies. So for instance, our Vietnam colleagues put together a case study of Ha Long Bay in northern Vietnam, which is a spectacularly beautiful place, but also just inland has massive coal mining. Um, uh, <coughs> um, and, you know, and, and, and the idea then is to, to bring together data in a particular way, and I'll talk about this, that, that allows you to kind of take this context, this issue, this problem, and, and um, <coughs> analyze it. Um, I'll come back to this uh, particular framework 